Tracy here from Hattie's Attic. It's a beautiful start to the weekend. I'm meeting some friends today for lunch. It's going to be a wonderful day off. So let's get the day started. Boy, it's foggy this morning. Here it is late August. Must be an indication that fall is just around the corner. You can hardly wait. I love the fall seasons. Get off that old computer, Tracy, and pay attention to me. See, I'm the baby. You're supposed to love me. Me and Sissy. Oh, hey, bees. Come here. Thank you, my girl. Love you. Love you. It's going on 11 o'clock here on a Saturday. My first full day off in quite a while. I was going to try and get a few things done this morning, but when the 5 o'clock alarm went off, I thought, no, I'll go ahead and sleep in. So I slept in, then I got up and I worked for one client that I do every day, no matter what. It's just an hour. Then I thought, well, I'm going to meet my friends at 3, so I'll go ahead and get my shower, and I'll get dressed. My logic in that is that, one, I won't have to rush, because I always wait till the last minute. Two, I can get my laundry started as soon as I get back this evening, because everything will be in the laundry hamper. And three, I want to go to Walmart a couple hours before I meet my friends because I have a list of a few things that I'd like to look at and not necessarily get today. But I'd like to get an idea on prices and what's available and just generally shop around. I haven't really been able to leisurely shop in a while. I don't go out of the house that much with my work schedule and by choice. That's the benefits of working from home. It's your choice. So I thought maybe I'd get that done today and I'm getting ready to take everything off my phone so that when I meet my friends today, I can film some stuff. They don't know it yet, but they're going to be on YouTube. <laughs> I hope they don't get mad. So I'm here at the Walmart, getting ready to go in, do a little bit of shopping. I'm going to return a few things. And just generally have a good leisure time until I meet up with my friends at 3 to have lunch. They have the fall stuff out. I love the colors of fall. Every year I say I'm going to get mums, and I never do. Maybe this year will be different. So I have a list. You see that? Maybe not. It's fuzzy. Anyways, I have a list. And we'll see how much I can get knocked off today. Let's see what I can get done, what I need, what I can wait. I'm pretty sure what I'm going to get. Just, I'm going to look at the other stuff as well. Get an idea. I need this one. But then I need, I need seven, eight, and nine as well. So this is the one I decided on. It's 148. I've never had a smart TV before, so this will be different. I hope I like it. I really do. This I would love in the kitchen. I could use as a pantry. It'd be about the right size, the right height, the right width. I knew exactly where I put it. But I'm going to have to wait on it because it's $69. I have to wait on that for another month. I came back out and this is what my car said the temperature was. This is ridiculous. With the heat index, absolutely ridiculous. What I totally forgot to put on my list, and I knew I wanted to look at it when I went in there, was treadmills. I've been wanting a treadmill for a long time, one that will fold up close to the wall so that when I'm not using it, it won't be in the way. And I totally looked, forgot to look and see if they had any. I'll have to look online. It'll probably be something I have to have shipped to the house anyways because I have no way of hauling it in my car. But I forgot to look, and that really makes me mad. I guess I'll get over it. I don't know. So I'm getting ready to meet my friends for lunch, dinner, whatever. It's 3 o'clock, so whatever you want to call it. They're not here yet. I'm a little bit early. That's fine. 
And of course, we are meeting at Fazoli's. We always say, well, where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? And it always ends up being Fazoli's because we all like our Italian and Ricky really loves his pizza. So that's fine. I like Italian. Anita likes Italian. We're all happy. So it'll be fun, no matter what. I still don't see him. I think I'll go inside because it's so hot. Give me something to drink and wait for him in the air conditioning. They're here. Oh my goodness. Of course, Ricky goes up to order his food. He doesn't know how to be polite. It was sad. Not Maybe that I didn't like the sister. Quit that. I didn't like the sister at all. But I like him a lot. I, I like the little lady from uh, Bones that yeah. told him of everything she saw. That was cool. I'm amazed they never made another part to that. <laughs> they made uh they made a sequel. He means three. Two is nothing like one except they did have the ki the people that died in the first one. <laughs> they had a Jeeper Creeper three. Three? Yeah, didn't they? No. Uh, we took the little boy in the cornfield in the beginning. Was that the one with the two. kids on the bus? Was that number two? Yeah. That's where it was, ate that I kid's head off. I actually like that one. It, if it, Gary was in the beginning of that one in that girl's dream. Yeah. I like that one. I felt sorry for the father and the brother. Yeah. It was sad. They're, they're always sad, though. It's got Stanley. You can give him Conroy in it, too. <laughs> What's well, The girls' dinner is almost done, and since I went out to eat with friends today, I didn't have any cheesecake or anything like I thought I might, so I think I might fix me some blueberry muffins. This is the same brand as I usually get, but it's a little bit different package, so I'm hoping it tastes just as good as before, if not better. Well, we've come to the end of another day here at Hattie's Attic. I'd like to thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And you have a good evening. Bye, guys.